Hi. Today we are going to solve the problem number 53, which is maximum survey on the code. So what is the description of the problem? The description is given an integer array nums. Find the contiguous subarray containing at least one number, which has the largest sum and it returns the sum. For example, if we consider this nums array, which is the and its elements are these minus 2, 1, minus 3, and so on, pick 4. Okay, its output will be 6. How its output is 6 is if we consider this uh, contiguous subarray and we add all the elements from 4 till 1, we will get our answer as 6, and which is the maximum of all the contiguous uh, subarray possible in this num array. So, what will be our approach to this problem? Uh, let's uh, let's start solving this problem by considering the elements. See, first element is minus two. So till now this is the maximum sum. If we add one to it, the sum will become minus one. And if we consider this single element, it is one. So what will be our uh, maximum till these two elements it will be 1 because minus 2 plus 1 is minus 1 and uh, 1 is greater than 1 and obviously so but till these two elements we, have, we could uh, see that the maximum sum is 1 and if you further add minus 3 to it uh, it will minus 2 now. so it will become minus 4 so again that will not be the maximum sum so so, like if we see till here, we have found 1 as the maximum sum. Okay. And so, till here, our maximum sum will be 1. And the current sum will be minus 3, uh, minus 3, 1, and minus 2. Okay. And if we again, now the next element will be 4. So, current sum will be the maximum of the current element and the current element current sum plus the current element. So it will be 4 in this case and so on. If we continue, continuously add uh, the coming elements, we will get the current sum and out of which, out of the current sum that we are uh, getting in uh, by adding the current element, the maximum of the current sum that will be the maximum. We will check everything. So let's look into the code. We have our code here. We will take two uh, variables, maximum sum and current sum, initialized to number zero. That is the zeroth element of number zero. And we will start with. So, current sum will be the maximum of nums i and current sum plus nums i. Why we are doing it? See, in this case, minus 2, if we consider these two, minus 2 was the previous sum, current sum, the previous sum, and if we add minus 2 plus 1, it will be minus 1, and this element is 1. So, our current sum will be the maximum of nums i oh, and current sum plus nums i. In this case, current sum plus nums i will be minus 1 and nums i will be 1. So, current sum will become 1. And maximum sum is maximum sum greater than current sum. That is, then obviously it's minus sum, otherwise it's current sum. We will go, we will continue this till the nums length and it the maximum. So it was an easy algorithm and the problem was also I hope it's clear. Thank you and have a nice day.